हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द वर्चुअल क्लास ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड कॉस्टिंग इन प्रीवियस सेशंस आई हैव डिस्कस्ड अ फ्यू प्रैक्टिकल क्वेश्चंस रिलेटेड टू सेल्स वेरिएंसेस टुडे आई एम हियर विथ अ न्यू वैरायटी इन सेल्स वेरिएंसेस on your screen you can read that today we'll discuss a question with incomplete data it is more mathematical than that of logical let us start question first calculate necessary figures and complete a database of concerned cells variances for product a b and c it means we need to remember that we are preparing these database for three different products cells value variance product a 1 lakh rupees favorable product c 34000 adverse total One lakh six thousand favorable. Sales price variance A sixty thousand favorable. B twenty thousand adverse. C eighteen thousand adverse. Sales volume variance. Product A forty thousand favorable. Product B sixty thousand favorable. Sales mix variance A four thousand favorable B twenty seven thousand six hundred adverse and in case of product C rupees forty four thousand eight hundred adverse sales sub volume or quantity variance product B thirty two thousand four hundred favorable. and product c 28800 favorable here the examiner has given information to us in a miscellaneous form in order to complete the database let us prepare a table and in tabular format arrange the informations given by the examiner so as you can check which information is given and which is missing sales value variance is missing in case of product b sales price variance is missing for total value sales volume variance is missing in case of product c and total sales mix variance is missing for total and sales sub volume or quantity variance is missing for product a as well as total slowly and gradually we will try to calculate all missing items in order to complete this table let us start our calculation with total sales value variance equals to sales value variance of product a plus product b plus product c now we have information of total sales value variance rupees 1 lakh 6000 favorable for product a it is rupees 1 lakh favorable for b it is missing and for a product c it is 34000 adverse as i said it is a mathematical question so we need to use mathematical sign favorable means plus and adverse means minus so i have arranged the data in the format total sales value variance 1 lakh 6000 equals to 1 lakh plus sales value variance of b minus 34000 as it is adverse change the side and find out sales value variance of product b it is nothing more than simple 
mathematical operation. The result of sales value variance of B is rupees 40,000. As the figure is positive, means 40,000, it is favorable. Suppose it is minus 40,000, that we need to refer this variance as 40,000 adverse. Anyways, right now it is rupees 40,000. So let us insert this data in the table. So take on your screen the missing number 40,000 favorable that we have completed over here is written in yellow color box. Now, after calculation of sales value variance for a product B, move towards next item. It is total sales price variance. Information related to sales price variance for product A, 60,000 favorable, product B, 20,000 adverse, and product C, 18,000 adverse is given. We have already completed these kind of calculations earlier. 60,000 favorable plus 20,000 adverse plus 18,000 adverse. So the difference is 22,000 favorable. You can check on your screen. It is written in yellow color box as we have completed a calculation using the information given by the examiner. Now, after calculation of two missing items, sales value variance for product B and total sales price variance, let us move to the next item. As we all know that we are using verification of sales variances with the help of sales value variance, sales price variance and sales volume variance. We have Total sales value variance of rupees 1 lakh 6000 favorable and total sales price variance rupees 22000 favorable. So amount of difference is rupees 84000 favorable. It is very easy for you to understand from the figure or else you can use formula mentioned over here. Sales value variance is equal to sales price variance plus sales volume variance. Figure of sales value variance is 1,6,000. We have already completed a calculation of total sales price variance rupees 22,000 favorable. Sales volume variance that we don't know. Insert the figure in the formula, change the side so as you can calculate the missing number total sales volume variance it is rupees 84,000. It is a plus 84,000. So we need to write 84,000 favorable. Now insert the data in the table. In the column of sales volume variance, that is fourth column. For product A, 40,000 favorable is given. Product B, 60,000 favorable is given. For product C, we don't know the amount of sales volume variance and total sales volume variance that we have completed just before a moment, 84,000 favorable. Now using this, you can easily complete the data which is not available to us for sales volume variance specifically for product C. And you can check on your screen. Sales volume variance for product C, it is also marked with yellow color box, rupees 16,000 adverse. If you don't want to calculate directly, you can use the formula total sales volume variance is equal to sales volume variance for product A plus product B plus product C. 84,000 is equal to 40,000 plus 60,000 plus for product C. So the result will be 16,000 adverse. You are free to calculate using the formula if you want to calculate. 
now concentrate on fifth column that is cells mix variance information related to cells mix variance for a product a 4000 favorable product b 27600 favorable and for a product c 44800 adverse already given by the examiner in our question now using these data for product a product b and product c we need to calculate total cells mix variance we have already completed this kind of calculation in earlier practicals so total cells mix variance is equal to 4000 favorable 27600 favorable 44800 adverse so you can easily complete the missing figure missing figure for total cells mix variance is rupees 13200 adverse you can check the figure is written in yellow color box instead of white question mark so slowly and gradually we have completed so many items now only two items are missing in the table one it's a cells sub volume variance for a product a and total cells sub volume or quantity variance now in order to calculate these two missing items we need to use this chart again that is a verification of cells variances as we all know that cells volume variances is combination of two variances that is cells mix variance and cells quantity variance cells volume variance that we have completed and calculated earlier rupees 84000 favorable cells mix variance is rupees 13200 just computed before a moment and so the difference is 97200 favorable if you are not clear for this you can use formula cells volume variance equals to cells mix variance plus cells sub volume variance amount of cells volume variance is rupees 84000 favorable so it is 84000 plus cells mix variance is given as 13200 adverse and we need to calculate value of cells sub volume variance so 84000 equals to 13200 adverse so it is a minus 13200 change the side if you change the side then 84000 minus minus 13200 is equal to cells sub volume variance as you all know that in mathematics minus minus plus so 84000 plus 13200 equals to 97200 this is the figure of cells quantity or sub volume variance it is not necessary to calculate using the formula if you directly judge the figure from the chart let us move for next part of calculation from the previous calculation we have derived figure of total cells sub volume variance it is rupees 97200 now focus on sixth and last column cells sub volume variance for product a it is not given for product b it is 32400 favorable and for product c it is rupees 28800 favorable so it's a very simple total cells sub volume variance equals to sub volume variance of product a plus product b plus product c you can use the formula in order to calculate the amount 
or you can easily calculate without any formula just enter the missing number and you will get figure of sales sub volume variance for product a rupees 36000 favorable now you can cross check first sales value variance 1 lakh favorable b 40000 favorable c 34000 adverse so the total sales value variance is rupees 1 lakh 6000 sales price variance 60000 favorable 20000 adverse 18000 adverse so total sales price variance is rupees 22000 favorable sales volume variance total 84000 favorable in case of product a 40000 favorable b 60000 favorable and c 16000 adverse sales mix variance 4000 favorable 27600 favorable and 44800 adverse for product a b and c respectively so the total result of sales mix variance is rupees 13000 adverse and last total sales sub volume variance rupees 97200 favorable in case of product a 36000 favorable b 32400 favorable and c 28800 favorable so in this way we can complete our calculation at the end for the purpose of your satisfaction and verification you can again fit this data in chart form so as you can cross check whether your calculations are correct or not here all five variances are associated with each other as per the requirement sales value variance rupees 1 lakh 6000 favorable price variance 22000 favorable volume variance 84000 favorable mix variance 13200 adverse and quantity variance 97200 favorable so all these variances are associated with each other so we can complete the database from incomplete information in this format using mathematical calculations thank you see you in next virtual class keep watching all the sessions very properly god bless you keep learning keep growing